Welcome. In front of me I have Xiaomi Watch S4 and I'm gonna show you how to pair this watch with the iPhone. First thing we need to do is to turn on our watch and you can turn it on by pressing and holding the lower button. Keep holding the button until you see the Xiaomi logo on the screen. Once you see the logo, you can release the button and wait until the watch is done booting up. And once the watch boots up, you will see the list of languages on the screen. You can scroll through it, find the language you would like to use on your watch, then tap on it to select it. And after you select the language, you will need to download and install the Mi Fitness application on the iPhone you want to pair your watch with. So go to your iPhone, make sure you have the uh, internet connection and Bluetooth enabled. Once you do, open the App Store. In the App Store, tap on search, then tap on the search bar and type in uh, Mi Fitness. And tap on search. And on the list of applications, you should see this app, Mi, Mi Fitness, formerly, formerly known as Xiaomi Wear Lite. Tap on it, then tap on the Get button to download and install it. Okay, and once the application is done installing, we can tap on open uh, to open it. In the app, we can tap on start. And if you see this pop up about the Bluetooth devices, tap on allow. Again, let's tap on start. Here we need to check the first box, box rather. You can also check the second one if you like to. I don't need to, I don't have a feeling. I don't feel like checking it. And then we can tap on agree. Next, we have se uh, select the region, basically. So tap on region right here. Scroll through the list, find the region you want to use and tap on it to select it. Then tap on next. And finally, you should see the health page of the app. Now tap on device icon to open the device page. On this page, tap on add device, tap on OK, and you will need to log in into Xiaomi account. If you don't have an account, you can tap on create account right here to make a new one and then use it to log in. I already have one, so I'm gonna enter the email address and password. Okay, and then we can tap on sign in. Oh, we need to agree to terms of use, and then we can tap on sign in. And after you log in, uh, you will see pop-ups about the permissions, for example, the notification permission. This is useful if you want to receive the notifications from your iPhone on your watch. If you don't care, you can deny it. If you want to use this feature, allow it. Next, we have the location permission. This is useful if you want to use features like local weather, tracking your route on the map and stuff like that. Anything that requires permission for the location. If you don't care, you can tap on allow. If you want to use it, tap on allow while using the app. Then we can agree to sync the data from all of our devices. And finally, you will see the device page again. Tap on add device. The app will start searching for the nearby devices. It should detect your Xiaomi Watch S4. Tap on it to select it. Then tap on pair. Tap on the check mark on your watch to confirm. Here, allow or deny the permission for the notifications. If you see this page, check or uncheck this box. This is about the automatic updates uh, through the um, Wi-Fi network. For some reason, it's in Chinese. I don't know why, but uh, you can check it or uncheck it, then tap on resume. Here we can select the menu layout, layout rather. Then we can tap on resume. And right here we can uh, enable the notifications for incoming calls. If you want to use them, check the box, tap on resume and allow the required permissions. If you don't care, you can tap on skip to keep it disabled. Uh, all right, because we need to share the contacts uh, for it to work. So we can select the contact. Uh, and now the contact will be added to the watch. And if it's calling you, it will be displayed on the watch's uh, screen. Okay, let's tap on resume. Here we can uh, also en enable the notifications for events and tasks and also uh, current location weather. You can skip it or check the boxes and turn it up on resume and allow the required permissions. Then we have the wearing guide. And once you're done, you should see the uh, device page and on it there should be your Xiaomi Watch S4. And if you go to your watch, you can go through the tutorial or skip it. And after the tutorial, you should see the watch face on your watch and you should be able to use it which means that the devices are uh, paired together. And that's how you pair this watch with the iPhone.
thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving a like on the video.